Hey everybody, Eric Grant, Director of Sales with Elan. I've got my virtual friend, Jeff Kaplinski over here. Jeff? Hello everybody, Jeff Kaplinski, Technical Specialist for Elan. So I'm gonna to talk to you guys about something really cool that we have added to our new SC line of controllers. And that is the software-based NVR. So we know through data that the average home has somewhere between four and five cameras that are added to their system. We also realize that in that kind of a four to five camera, price is something that is very, very important. So what we're gonna talk about is how we're gonna leverage the horsepower of our new SC controllers and really give all end users the robust experience of a lawn surveillance. So I'm gonna kick it over to Jeff and Jeff's gonna talk about what the hardware requirements and how to physically execute this. And then we'll come back and really talk about the full solution together. So Jeff? Yeah, thanks Eric. It's a really cool feature with this. Four channel software in VR. Um, a couple of things you need to know. First of all, this can work in conjunction with our hardware system. So if you've got a, a system deployed out there that's got eight cameras, end user wants to add one more camera, two more cameras, which happens quite frequently, this is a solution we can offer them without buying another eight channel in VR, six channel in VR at a more cost effective point. So what do we need to make this work? We're using the new controller, SC100, SC300. And we're going to use a dealer-supplied USB hard drive. We do have a list of hard drives that we recommend and we've tested on the dealer interface portal. Um, and basically, it just plugs into the back of the controller through the USB. And in programming, you add it as an onboard NVR. And then you get your additional port channels. And that's still assigned as you would normally assign our traditional hardware NVRs. A couple of cool features that we have only available in the software NVR is the ability to add custom events. So we have the ability in programming to go in and based on something as a trigger, whether that be a, a, a door faulted to the security system, a driveway sensor, garage door opening, can then tell it to record on a specific channel and key that as a color-coded event where you can reference back on the user interface. Now you'll have motion, you'll have vehicle, you'll have person identification, but then you'll also have any number of custom triggers that you uh, set in programming be able to be sorted and viewed on NVR playback. Eric? Thanks, Jeff. So again, the cool thing with this is no additional hardware is needed other than the USB uh, hard drive that gets plugged into the back of the controller. And again, the mindset of this entire thing is how do we put more surveillance into more jobs by helping you guys do it at a more economical price point. With all of this being tied in through the Elan control system, all of your analytics, as long as you're using Elan cameras, are brought inside of this. And all of your user experience being tied back into the Elan interface for your NVR is also done through here. So again, the mindset is more surveillance, more jobs, but bringing the cost of this solution down to your end users and to you as the dealer. Again, cool feature that we're adding through Elan. Thanks for joining us, guys.